25-year-old Pauline Alwatch of Viero is sorting through pieces of paper on her desk. They are from 10 different schools in Kibra, and written on each piece of paper is a message of distress. Pauline is a mentor at Polycom Development Project. She's been working here for the last one and a half years. The program was launched in 2010 and has reached over 10,000 girls under the age of 18. They were fearing their fellow pupils who scare us to resolve. So we decided, we sat down and strategized. Then we came, we came up with that, that idea, Ju. Mtu wakiandika hauta muona, akiweka pia hauta ona, then the student won't know nini ya meandika. On Pauline's itinerary today is a counseling session at the Global One School in Kibra's Katwekera village. The mother of two has a one-on-one -on -one counseling session with Grace, not her real name. The 15-year-old has been neglected by her mother who has since remarried. The class 7 pupil bears the marks of assault on her body after her very own mother turned against her, claiming she's an unwanted burden in her new family. Pauline only helps with psychosocial support. This is just a case among the 3,000 queries that Polycom receives weekly from the 50 schools. The most appearing issue, defilement and uh, sexual harassment. If several girls have the same problem, the volunteers will arrange a group session where the girls come up with a solution together. If it's a more general issue, the volunteers take it to the teachers or school administration. If a girl includes her name with her message, one of the volunteers will find her to address her concerns directly. I had a friend who, who has a, a problem of she was abused sexually by a guardian. So she was unable to speak it out. But the, when the talking box was introduced, I advised her to write her problems. And since she wrote the problems, her problems were all solved. The program targets primary school girls and works with other institutions like hospitals, where they refer cases that are beyond them. So I According to Lona Muliro, a matron at Global One School, most of the cases she has handled are issues to do with parents' negligence and sometimes defilements. So I have to go make sure I sit with the parent, I talk to them, talk to the children, so that they know that they are, it is just them who should provide to the children, not somebody else. Pauline has built a rapport with the girls and has maintained confidentiality, which makes them open up more to her. There are these games that we do play. I start by telling my own stories. So after telling my story, you get that a girl is even able to stand in front of fellow people to say, Kama sister, they call me sister. Kama sis, I'm the same story. I also must say my story. Resulting from an overwhelming need, an added emphasis on fighting gender-based violence, violence awareness and response services. The talking box has come a long way in combating this. Diana Rose, Switch TV.